can't make any promises on that whole being professional thing. I cannot make We any are getting ready. Look at that. You told me that we couldn't interrupt the workout. I cannot make any promises. We are getting ready for lifting. I so grab some possible. weights. If I can put this video back on. <laughs> grab some weights and let's go. Come on, but we <clears throat> we are from Roman first, guys. Yesterday's workout. Who is sore? I am sore. Peasant, are you like sore from yesterday? I'm in a different workout. Are they sore? A little bit. Mine are super sore. So that's why we are, we need to do extra foam rolling. Quads, hamstrings, inner thighs, glutes. I'm gonna go right into the sides. This one has the spikes, so I wanna make sure that I have less tension on it. Right here. Hamstrings. Sit on it and just foam roll it. You're gonna feel less on the hamstrings than on the quads. It's definitely less. But still gonna release that tension in there. So do it. Mine are right underneath the butt, but right there, that tightness. This is gonna break. This is gonna break. Ranka, step away. Daisy, can you not do this? Just come closer. All right, switch your leg, guys. I'm gonna ride into loops. So sit on that foam roller. You're doing the left one, bring that left over right. Keep your hands behind. And just foam roll all the way top to the bottom. You can really rotate that leg in. Take that leg, take that whole foot right here, the whole leg, the whole glute in it. Now, Gonna do right glute, and we are going to stop. So you need a bench or no bench? Bench or no bench? It's, if you have one, that's great. If you don't, just do it on the floor. We're gonna do a. Sequence of four chest press, front squat, then we have alternating chest press and a deadlift. So, I'm gonna start with 20. What's your weight? I'm not sure. I'm gonna lay down on the, on the bench. We're gonna start with the first one. Ready? Let's go. So if you're laying on the floor, your knees will be bent. You're gonna pump that chest. So deep breath in is down, exhale is up. So both arms are going at the same time. This is just a warm up round. Now the first one we're gonna do, warm up for the legs a little bit more. So we're gonna do a squat and a quad stretch. So alternate your legs, squat to a quad stretch. If you did quad stretches before, you're just gonna pop those legs right here for me, just squatting up and down, that's it. Nice and low, you can go below those knees. 
can go a little bit below. You can go all the way down, that's great. Depends how your hips feel. So engage your abs, engage your glutes, hamstrings. A few more guys, get ready. I'm gonna use the bench. You can use whatever you want. Reach towards your toes and stand up straight. And again, reach and stand up straight. So facing forward, switch on the other leg. So toes are up. You wanna reach forward, stretch those hamstrings. Good. Time. We're gonna get back to the dumbbells. You don't need to go heavier. Let's do the same kind of weight again. This is, remember, this is just the beginning. We're gonna do alternating chest press right here. So one arm at a time. So it's not this. Both, le both arms at 90 degrees. You're gonna press one at a time and still flat, flat chest press. Breathe out, go slowly down, press it up and down, and again. And time. Now, deadlift. You can use dumbbells or you can use kettlebell. So if you have a kettlebell, the motion will be right here. Kettlebell will be right in the center. You're gonna lean forward and then stand up straight, okay? Now with, with dumbbells, you're gonna keep those dumbbells to the side, thinking like a suitcase motion, up and down like this. So I'm gonna get start with lighter. And again, are you using kettlebell? Are you using dumbbell? Let me know. Write it down in the comments there. So how we do deadlift? You lean forward, it's not a squat. You push your hips back, your back is straight, elbows are right to the side, and then stand up straight. So don't lock your knees. Concentrate on squeezing the glutes and hamstrings, pulling the belly button in towards the spine, like really engaging it. Right here, you're gonna feel it. Everything, glutes, hamstrings, abs. You're gonna feel in your shoulders because you're holding that weight. I'm not rounding the spine and I don't want you to do the same. Just don't go like this because remember it's hinging through the hips. So it's hinging right here through the hips. Now, for those of you who want to add maybe extra cardio into it, you can even grab a jump rope right now to do about 30 seconds, 45 seconds quick jump rope. Maybe run up the hill if you have a hill. Or maybe you are at the beach and you want to do a sprint back and forth. That's great. See, Debra. Hello. All right, guys. So now, back to the beginning. We're going to still go in a, a chest. Uh, chest press flat. I'm gonna increase these dumbbells. I'm gonna go a little heavier. We're gonna repeat this a second to four. I'm getting 25 each. What's your weight? Write it down. Maybe you need some advice. You can type it in the comments later. Let's do this. Both dumbbells at the same time. Maybe count the repetitions, how many you can do. I have 12 right now. Went 
cheat too. Guys, why we do this? We want to be able to keep the same pretty much numbers and also this will show you, okay, can I increase the weight? Can I go a little heavy? We're doing a squat. Now the squat then is no longer be a body weight squat. The first one that we did, who's the chair for, for me to rest? <laughs> All right, listen. <laughs> Just one, that's fine. Work with one, work with one dumbbell. Work with what you have, let's go. Remember that I told you weeks ago how I teach you, can be foot away from the wall. Foot away. Now when you go down, your glutes will hit the, will hit the wall or whatever you have behind you to support you right there. And then you're gonna know that you are in a perfect uh, deadlift position because you're gonna lean back. That's how it shows you. It's great to do that. You never try this. Try it now. Now, keep those shoulder blades back and down. Because when you go forward, a lot of you will let those dumbbells go here and you put so much pressure on your lower back. Okay? So look, these dumbbells stay to the side, exactly where they were. Deep breath in and exhale. Hinge, hinge through the hips. You're gonna feel this in your arms, forearms, grip. Of course, you're increasing the weight. Get in sync with your breathing. Inhale here, exhale up there. Drink your water, drink your pre-workout. Hello, Liz. All right, guys, share this page with your friends and your loved ones, share it. 
tag someone in this workout maybe they will happen later maybe they can do it now because it's a full hour of training let's do it so grip is going stretch it open up your chest oh feels awesome let's go again regular and then alternating and then we're gonna move to rows so everything is gonna be pull bend over okay hear those cute voices they're singing cute right
shoulders, abs, forearms, arms, glutes, hamstrings, squats, everything is working. Get in sync with that breathing. Oh. You know what fails? It does not fail my abs, my hamstrings. The grip failed. That's what it is. My grip is weaker. My grip is weak overall. It's a weak grip. So that's something that I always have to work for. Just to hold 25 for me on each is pretty good. So if your grip is weak, just holding and training those will help you. Anyway. Now drop it right here with this drink. We're going into bent over, my friends. So if you if you've been staying on, now you should know what's gonna be the theme. Puff, lower, alternating puff. Okay? So bend over. I'm gonna put a little bit to the side. Let's go over the motions, stretch a little bit. We're gonna have reverse lunger, lunges, and we're gonna have drop lunge. So, bend over row is pretty much the same. Well, Steve is actually doing single arm, but we're gonna do both arms. Both arms bend over row. So, this is like a halfway position of the deadlift. Because you are right here, you're not standing up, you just pretty much, that's the position when you're going to be in it. So quads and hamstrings and glutes and abdominals must be engaged. That's the position. Now, you're going to feel this muscle working, that's how it should be, but you should not be rounding it like this, okay? So I want you to pay attention. You have a mirror, stay in front of the mirror, and let's roll. I'm going to start with lighter again. It's a new motion for my body. So even if I did deadlift, I wanted to stay and with my left shoulder width apart. Back is straight, head tight, good tight. And we're all gonna roll. Count. We're gonna 
create instability right here, okay? You want to go heavier? Go heavier. I'm going to get my 20s.
Can you try to peek? All right. So as you see, I am not, I'm right there. Legs kind of shoulder or hip width apart, stepping back in line. I'm not trying to bring my right leg to my left. I'm just going, stepping back. 90, 90, 90 degrees. You don't need to tap with that back knee into the ground. If it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen, but that's not your goal. I'm, I'm breathing heavy because it's difficult. Heavy enough. Right? So, now, bend over row, alternating. Let's do this. Now, if for any reason you start feeling this, I want you to decompress the spine and your lower back. Just lay down on the floor. Take a deep breath in, opposite motion, and exhale. Drop those hips. Look at up to the ceiling. I don't want you to engage your, your glutes. That's not the point. I just want you to kind of sink down. Maybe extend your arms. Sit here for a second. Lay down on the floor. Bring both of your knees. Hug them. And that's how you're going to release that tension a little bit. Okay? So, grab those dumbbells. First rep is as important as the last one. Lifting dumbbells, dropping them on the floor is as important as anything else. Let's do this. Now you know the proper motion, movement, forward, pump those dumbbells, let's roll. Evenly on both sides, that right and left should be digging in. something that is coming up. Guys, listen, August 5th, there's going to be an outstanding, amazing webinar for mind, body, and business. That's going to be a free webinar for those who want to learn something and not only learn, but start implementing immediately into their lives. So serious people are welcome only. Those who will submit their email submit their form and actually show up okay if you've been a person that you've been scheduling thousand different things over promising never delivering that's not for you okay i want serious people who will show up who will know that this is something that they need to do because their life sucks right now all right so Ah, you've been experiencing this this is going to be for you amazing content for 90 minutes straight ha get ready you're gonna see soon info that you can submit yourself and this is gonna be on august 5th 2021 i'm saying this date because some of you will watch this video 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, 40, 50, 100 years from now. And you're going to be like, where is this uh, webinar? This coach doesn't even exist anymore. Oh, maybe I will. Maybe we are, will be at 2045 and they already will put your information into the hard drive and create a clone out of you. And you're going to live forever. You never know what's coming. Ah, loosen up, maybe some circles. The freak always laughs at me. This is a magical motion. Do it with me, do it with me. I promise you're gonna feel amazing. Look at that. It feels so good. Loosening up those hips. <laughs> Who is laughing? All right. So, back again, the same thing.
matters right now for this moment. Go. Breaking sweat. All right, my 30, right here, reverse lunges. Ooh. Guys, we're working hard. This is good, I'm gonna show you sideways. Ready, let's go. Deep breath in, and exhale. It's funny how the body's already shaking. If you're putting a good work on your muscles, they will shake. You're gonna put work, good work on your brain. You're gonna feel accomplished. Ah! Ah! Do it, do it, do it! Deep breath in. And exhale. Right here, so many muscles working. Ah. Oof. Breathe, guys. Don't hold the breath. You gotta breathe. Otherwise, you're gonna get lightheaded. Time. As you go, you move, and the heart the rate keeps on going like faster and faster. Last one. I can tell I'm not gonna take it anymore here for my pedal, and then we're gonna go into incline. I'm not increasing the weight on my bed over. Ugh. I'm staying where I am. Alternating arms, go. Here and there, you can track your position, but I don't want you to look down on your feet. That's a bad habit. into the next section. High five for staying on. Guys, the whole point is to stay here and do this workout. Good job, Ivanka. I saw you nice squats. How many pounds would you have, Ivanka, for your kettlebell? Okay, okay? Totally okay. 
So incline, adjust your benches, please. Adjust your workstation. And uh, let's roll. Okay, so now we're gonna do a step up. I'm gonna get a step. You guys get your steps. Step up, and then you're gonna do a split squat. Now, I'm gonna do lower but heavier load. Lower but heavier load, okay? Now you can do higher and heavier load if your lower back is fine, if your glutes are okay, totally fine. But don't go higher than your knee level. That's the, that's the requirement. Okay, don't go higher than that, please. All right, now, guys, some of you do not have a bench. Some of you do not have a bench. So you might use a stability ball, maybe put it against the wall, secure with the dumbbells or something heavy that is not moving and just do an incline. But maybe you are at them and you found the bench that you can do this. That would be awesome because that's, that's the goal right now. So we are doing the incline press. Uh, let's go, we have a lot of cover. Woo. My legs are on fire. What's on fire with you? Make a comment if you are doing it here on Facebook with me or if you're doing it on Facebook, on, on YouTube. Let's go. Okay. 
that was hard. Now, split squat. Let's check the time. Good on time. Split squat. We're gonna go halfway and halfway, okay? So we're gonna step back with your right leg. You're gonna remain this position right here. So your body is in the center of both of your legs. You're going straight down and straight up. That's it, shoulders back, chest is, the chest is down. Deep breath in and exhale. Waving, you know, I'm like a banker. We wave, <laughs> we wave to people. Ah. All right, so back on the press on the incline. And I repeat this again, guys August 5th, you will have a chance to. Submit your information for the free webinar only if you want to go to the next one. Only. Want to go to the next level? You've been struggling in your mind, body, and business. This is going to be something new for you. And I request your sign in. Yes, let's go. Both. Shh. Shh. Almost there. Ah. Ah. Ooh. Time. Get a heavier dumbbell. Let's do step up. Are you sweating? I hope you are. Ah. Let's go. You know how it goes. Left, right, right, left. You have the horrible coordination, stick to the same leg, do a few, and then do a few on the other leg, okay? Make sure entire foot is stepping over that step. I love when I reach that moment when my whole body is like shaking, because that, that means I put on such a hard work right now. Abs tight, glutes tight, guys. Yes, heavier the dumbbell, harder it is to hold it. And the heart rate will be increasing. Alternating incline press right now. Whew. All right, today is Wednesday, going live at 12 15 p.m. Pacific. No excuses, ladies. Today we're going to be talking about to do the best that you can in the current situation in preparation for the upcoming vacation. So many of you gaining weight during the summer. So join me on some tips so we can change the pattern that you have been doing for a long time. 
All right, we gotta get those dumbbells. Somebody stole my 20s. Man down, man down. Information center. Press it. Press it. Uh, oh, oh, God. Guys. Difficult stuff. All right, split squat. Maybe you want to start with the other leg first. Fine. Start with your left or your right. Doesn't matter. Go. Straight down, straight up. Make sure you guys see me. This last round? Oof. Switch your legs. You can go a little bit more. Go. Because you know how the workout goes right now. So you can pause it. We're going to have one more. One more here. And then we're going into overhead presses, bicep curl. We're gonna go into a forward alternating lunge. If we have to cut on this one, we will because the most important is to do. No, you got to do your last flat set. Bicep curl, curl. Okay? So, let's go. No time to waste because the time is now that here, 11.02. We gotta go. And I still wanna stretch with you because I feel like I can't move anymore. Ah! Let's go, pump it. I switch and I lower my dumbbells on the incline. Good job, Ivanka. Thank you. Almost there. Nice work. guys incline incline alternating presses let's do this take a deep breath in exhale Go. 
go. Ah. Dicey, stop it. Ready for overhead press. If your lower back is weak, I want you to put that bench into totally 90 degree angle. You're gonna sit against it. Ooh, so cute! 90 degrees, and you're gonna do overhead press, okay? thousand different ways. The same workout. Go. Overhead. 90. So many of you go here. Right here guys, 90 degrees. Yeah. 
very much. Spooky. Yeah. Spooky. <laughs> How many pounds do you have there? Six. Oh, my, I mean, three and three, right? Yeah. Okay. Six in total. Oh, six in total and three and three in your hands. And how old are you now? Seven. Seven. How did you seven like in four months? Yeah. 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 And these dumbbells match there your outfit. Eight. Oh, there it is. The dumbbells match your outfit. Now I'm doing 16 pounds. Whoa. Eight, eight and eight? eight? in this position and switch Ew. awesome job everybody oh, this was great high five Rubik let me know how you like the workout. Let me know if you have done it. Don't forget that the workouts, you can subscribe yourself on the YouTube channel. I'm going to post the link, guys. Post the link for you so you can subscribe. And don't forget that August 5th, we're going to have that webinar. So all information will be posted. You're going to get an email. Make sure that you're subscribing if you, if you really feel like you're looking for something different, like never before, because... It was never done before. So 
this is gonna this is an absolutely a new program that we have created and developed nothing like ever been done before so stay tuned for information be on the lookout for creeps behind me i will talk to you guys later have a no excuses day bye